What's up guys? You are on my head because we're a little bit late. Today, I'm a spectator of this man. No, that's a weird that's a weird sentence, yeah. But he called me first one. I'm gonna get in this car while we're while we're doing this because we are quite late. But anyways, Erwan told me that he's got a photo shoot with what's his name? Pierre Gasly. There you go. He's a legend here in France. Racing well F1 driver. I'm gonna need to put me little lights on here, right? Okay. Right, so yeah, he was like, listen, I'm gonna I've got a video shoot with Pierre Gasly for a simulator company, local simulator company. Morning. Um, and I was like, listen, that sounds like something my audience would be interested in. Do you mind if I just tag along and uh, put a camera on my head? And he was like, no problem. Also, conveniently, they needed cars for this photo shoot, and so we're going to use my cars. So there you go, that is the recap of what's going on. He's gonna drive this one up, I think. I want him to drive one car up, one car down, so he gets to experience both. All right. I'm gonna go get the Porsche. Da -da 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 -da. Bonjour. Perfect. Sorry, take the window down on the key to be able to get in more easily. This one's not as hard. Okay. This is never easy. Ta-da! I hope he's got a, enough fuel in his tank. One thing that's uh, almost for sure, I hope not, but it seems like it is that we'll wake up the neighbors. He's driving valves closed right now, which is why I can hear myself think. I hope he finds the button to open them though, so he enjoys it properly. The only thing is he's got a pretty cold engine right now. Actually, so do I. I'm in all my comfort modes, auto mode, cruising, easy peasy, definitely easier than, uh, than him right now. It's weird seeing the car driving from behind and it makes me think that the yellow, we painted the 430 logo yellow and the yellow diffuser, I think looks pretty cool. Because it's a different thing seeing it stationary and seeing it moving. What do you guys think of the spec of the 430? <laughs> that noise. No lift in that one. In mine there is, but I didn't even need it there. You know what the irony of this is? That is, a track car, full-blown track car. This is like a daily, more, much more daily, dailyable, I guess would be the word, car. But that, this is actually faster, considerably faster than that, I think. Maybe not on track, but um, in general, this thing will put its power down much more. It's got more power than the Scud. It's also 10 years newer, so all the technology and everything to, to be able to put that power down. But it's funny when you think about it that that, which looks so impressive, makes so much noise, etc., is actually slower than this. Let's overtake him. There we go. It looks so cool behind him. I hope I'll be able to film, by the way, at the track. Let me just put my light on. I bet you he's going to accelerate in here. But uh, yeah, I hope I'm going to be able to film with Gasly. You guys can hear him but yeah because f1 drivers it's often complicated because they've got all their sponsors etc um to uh, to be able to film with them is sometimes complex and i'm just kind of showing up with a gopro on my forehead so hopefully that will work out if not i'll tell you all about it what is for sure is that we're going to see some cool cars because we're going to a car storage place and uh, they should have some pretty cool supercars around so, 
fingers crossed that we're going to be able to film those as well. But yeah, I've, I've met uh, Pierre Gasly once. Obviously being French and being a French driver, uh, one of my favorite F1 drivers. Uh, and I met him for an interview at the Alpha Tauri launch uh, two years ago. <laughs> and he was, he was really nice. So excited to see him again. Always feels surreal to be filming these kind of, well, when I say filming, I'm actually not doing anything. I'm just coming along for the ride. So we're going to sport mode for this last bit. I cannot wait for my exhaust to get here because the noise, yeah, it, I miss it when I'm in this one a little bit, I have to admit, especially when I can hear that right behind. But it'll be here soon. There's, there, I mean, it makes a nice noise, this car, but there's so much potential for more. Alors, on y arrive. Ta-da! Ah ouais, il y a du sérieux. Il y a du très très sérieux même. Pouah! Incroyable. Okay, I'm gonna park and then I'm gonna, then I'll film this. All right, I'm in the turbo still. I've come back to talk to you guys because they're hiding the plates of the cars because this is a car storage area. They're hiding all the plates, but yeah. until they've done that, I can't film outside of this car. So here you go, Gasly's about to arrive. So I wanted to give you a little update. Ooh. So yeah, before before they got here, I just wanted to update you in case when they get yeah. here, the plates aren't hidden and I can't film. But I'll be able to show you the cars at some point. So this clip's basically useless. What are we doing here? Okay, I can show you around really quickly. Erwin's doing the whole setup. You can see behind me, there's the simulator. Pretty crazy simulator, one off for Gasly. Really cool, and then with all the screens, anyways, all the lights around. This is all oh, and set up with the with the lighting. Anyways, it's all it's all very very nice. I'm intrigued more by the cars. So now that they've covered the the, the plates up, we've got a um, matte black 488, really cool, with the sports seats in red leather. I need to do this kind of quick because it's all about to kick off. I think we've got this awesome TDF. So whoever spec this had zero budget it has all of the carbon everywhere gold wheels painted ferrari shields that's an option usually they come as a standard shield like that much bigger and painted blue alcantara interior don't know if you can really see inside hello we then got this pista which is lovely both of these are i believe in triple layer paint different colors i don't know exactly which ones but yeah expensive whatever they are um, and this one actually doesn't have the carbon wheels, but not to worry. If you want to see the carbon wheels, right next to a gold SVJ with a red interior, bold, there is this beautiful blue pista with carbon wheels, which is about a 30,000 euro option. Beautiful spec, I think, on this one. It's got the blue seat belts to match inside. We've got a 600LT Spider, um, which is lovely, with the full carbon front splitter, expensive option, carbon here, carbon, carbon all over the place. This is awesome, GTR Nismo, you guys uh, probably know this quite well, they're quite rare, carbon here, everywhere, I mean, I, mean, I just talk about carbon, carbon, carbon all the time, but, oh look, even the massive rear wing, so cool. Um, what else do we have, we have, let me just navigate my way through here, okay, we've got a 458, I love these with a pretty bold spec inside. This, which you guys all know very well, Speciali, Dino, and then here, sorry. Sorry for all the voices, guys. I'm kind of just trying to do this as, as much as I can. 812 GTS right here, which is super nice. These are gonna be, uh, well, I know that, well, I know. I've been told that uh, there aren't that many being sold, so these could be a potential keeper for the future for whoever's got them, like this person who's storing it. Um, because there won't be that many, V12 top-down, um, potentially a future classic, I think, so really, really nice. Anyways, that's a quick tour of all the cars here. There are a few things which I'm not really supposed to show you, but we will anyway. Um, well, we've got, see right behind there, there is a Bugatti under the cover, and then a few other cool things under the cover. Annoyingly, a lot of what is around, I can't actually show you, I don't know, the eagle-eyed viewers will have maybe spotted a McLaren P1 at some point. Let me know if you did, and if you did, what color it was in, in the comments down below. But anyways, this is the simulator, which is pretty epic. Look at that. So, so cool. Anyways, and the light setup and all that jazz. Anywho, I'm just going to film discreetly in my corner while it all kicks off now.
Attention, ça va faire un peu de bruit. Hein. Oh, and it went well? Yeah, very well. Happy? Yeah, very happy. Good. All right, well, you take the Porsche back down. I'm going to take this one. I'm late for lunch now. Take care. See you. All right, well, that's that then. I'm now back in the Ferrari. I have to head off. I'm super late for lunch now. But uh, that was cool. That was really cool. I'm happy for Erwan. Fun always supporting kind of the projects by bringing the cars and stuff like that. So I'm happy it all went well for him. Cool project. And um, yeah, no, that was pretty fun. I thought it was a cool little thing to film for you guys too. Let me know if you enjoy these kind of, even if it wasn't a particularly well put together video, just a little behind the scenes type thing. And there we go. So. Thanks for watching the video guys, uh, I'll see you very soon, I'm sure, please subscribe if you aren't already, and we'll be back with plenty more content of this type soon, cheers, bye bye.